She's a combination of enthusiasm, passion actually, energy, creativity, and will. Dara has a sweetness and a sensibility and compassion that also drives her. As we got to know PJ, we realized he matches Dara in every way. So much fun, fiercely loyal, and the ultimate supporter of Dara. In getting to know Dara, she's beautiful, funny, accomplished, well-traveled, everything that you've heard today and this evening. And perhaps most importantly for the rest of us, she really keeps PJ in line. He's a handsome dude, that's for sure, but he's so much more. He's smart, athletic, hardworking, and as a father, I like to see that. You are an ocean of adventure. You are a fabulous fashionista, fiberista, student, athlete, and a wonderful, loving friend. And all your friends, they so adore you. I see how he treats Dara, and I know he's right for Dara. He's calm and confident and self-aware. He possesses equanimity. It's a rare but wonderful quality that helps balance Dara. Kind-hearted, loves his family and friends, has strong values, and is equally passionate and curious about the world around him. Dara was in Oaxaca with me, and she was going to move the next day to Washington, D.C. So she said to me, Mom, I do not want to live in Washington, D.C. I don't want to go there. So she goes there the first two days she meets PJ. About a year later, she says to me, Mom, I want to live in Washington my whole life. I am so happy to hand my little girl with the pretty curls to such a stellar person. Dara, you know what's important. You work hard and play hard as well. You are fiercely loyal and wonderful, wonderful trait. I am so proud of the woman you have become. presence of our family and friends. I, Dara Chase Egan. I, Dara Chase Egan. Choose you, Paul Joseph Smith III. Choose you, Paul Joseph Smith III. <laughs> to be my life partner. To be my life partner. In the presence of our family and friends. I, Paul Joseph Smith III. I, Paul Joseph Smith III. Choose you, Dara Chase Egan. Choose you, Dara Chase Egan. To be my life partner. To be my life partner. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better, for worse. For better or for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. In joy and in sorrow. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. And to be faithful to you alone. And to be faithful to you alone. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. Love is sacrifice. It's not 50-50 in a marriage. It's 110 and 110. She has an unmatched energy and enthusiasm. Daryl will fly across the world for one night if it means being there for a friend. PJ shares Dara's 
Zest for life and prioritization of relationships. I knew he was the right guy when I saw him get down on my kids' level and spend hours with them. He makes them feel so special. Take time to be present with each other. Take time to find moments to just laugh and be together. I know you'll design a beautiful life together. Enjoy the journey. Don't forget to enjoy every single day along the way. Dara and PJ, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Mr. and Mrs. Smith, you may now kiss the bride. And they are inseparable. Nothing you can do to, you know, get the two of them away from each other. Dara, in your world, the most important person is PJ. And PJ, in your world, the most important person is Dara. You are now partners, a team. You must come first in each other's eyes. Dara and PJ, may your love be modern enough to survive the times, but old-fashioned enough to last forever.